I got to treat this guy with respect or he'll put me in a chokehold or something. But it is awesome to have Olympic wrestler and Bellator welterweight champ Ben Askren of Heartland now living in Tosa. And he's got the belt to prove that he's the champ and back it up. Ben, thanks for taking the time today. I won't ask any crazy questions or anything like that. No problem. Thanks for having me. It's good to uh, you know, <laughs> be home now that I've been living here for a year. And yeah. come on. I know you, it was my first TV interview ever about 12 years ago. How about that? That is, uh, it's crazy. <laughs> we go way back. All right. First of all, you competed in Beijing in 2008. You had success, but you also didn't think that you ranked among the best. I remember the memorable quote. You said, I sucked. How hard is it at this level to compete? It's extremely difficult. Everyone's, everyone's great. Mm. And you go there and... You're so used to winning and then you come out on the wrong side of it. It's just, uh, it's not what you want, it's not what you expect. And uh, I had got very used to winning in the last couple of years at Missouri and then going into the Olympic, you know, international competition. I didn't lose very much. Mm. And so when I went there and I lost, it, it was just very upsetting. Hmm. I know you know a little bit and follow it a little bit, especially the freestyle. Jordan Burroughs, one of the favorites, obviously, and then Stevens Point native Ben Provisor, we just talked about in Greco Roman wrestling. What do you think their chances are? Who are you going to be kind of watching? I'm excited for this year. I think the United States freestyle team has a better team than they've had in, in a long time, maybe mm. since 04 or even earlier than that. Wow. And I know Jordan Burroughs won the gold medal last year, and he's been outstanding this year in international competition. He should do very, very well. Uh, in Greco, Brent Weiser, obviously a Wisconsin native. I've seen him wrestling since he was just a, a little kid, I remember. And, uh, you know, this will be his first Olympics, his first world team he's made. Mm -hmm. He's really young, and so... You know, he's going to have a tough experience over there, and hopefully he can come out on top. That's awesome. Uh, third question, you, your brother Max, high school coach John Messenbrink, run the Askren Brothers Wrestling Academy. You train at Duke Rufus Academy with your MMA stuff. You're pretty entrenched in Milwaukee, aren't you? You're a Milwaukee guy. Of course. I, I grew up here. Uh, I left to go to college in Missouri, and I was out in Arizona for a couple of years, but uh, never forgot my roots. Uh, mm. Remained a Brewers fan, even though it was long and hard sometimes. <laughs> uh, and you know Packers fan and then got the chance to come back home last year mm -hmm. uh, work with Duke Rufus who I think is one of the elite striking coaches and MMA coaches uh, on the planet wow. when we're talking about it and uh, that was awesome and then we also opened up the Asking Wrestling Academy out there in Heartland with uh, hired my high school coach to be the the main coach there and mm -hmm. it's been going great get to work with the local kids and uh, it's been getting a great reception that's awesome now Blast from the past, Ben mentioned it. I believe I was the first Milwaukee TV reporter to do a story on this guy, and here's a clip from that interview. As long as I do what I can do, that there really shouldn't be anybody can come close to me at all. And yeah, of course, Muhammad Ali's one of my idols. I love, I just love the style of what he did. He has, he talked. Everybody else thought he was cocky, but he knew what he could do. You know, he calls around, he knocks him out in the round. You had the gift of gab and even great hair back then, Ben. I love it. Yeah, you know, I was never really afraid to speak my mind. Uh, you know, ever since I was a young kid, just kind of been with it, and it never it stuck with me. And uh, it still bothers a lot of people to this day, even though mm -hmm. uh, you know all the things I accomplish, they still think I can't, and they still doubt me. But uh, I'm gonna keep on talking and keep on doing it. <laughs> what would you do if I'd steal that belt on you right about now? Uh, you know, I don't know if that end up so well for you, Lance. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe some other time we'll we'll have a little match and it'll last all of ten seconds. Thanks, Ben, for the time. No problem. Thanks for having me. All right, Ben Askren joining us. Jake, take it away before I get hurt or something. Go for it, Lance. We <laughs> want to see this yeah, happen. We, we want to sure see you do. Go, <laughs> <No>, Ben. <laughs> By the way.